What's going on everybody? This is Super Robot Ed and we're going to talk about some images from two users for the Transformer Studio Series SS-109 Leader Class Bumblebee Movie Concept Art Megatron. It was available today at the Singapore Comic Con 2023 for purchase y'all. So we got in-hand images of everything we see here so far from 2005 board member Jay Hund and a Instagram user Joanne underscore Ying 79 we have clear shots of the toy now some of them are comparison shots like you see here with uh, the uh, shockwave uh, there's some be some other comparisons he's fairly large um you know but not as large as like a Grimlock and we'll see that later on but he's definitely bigger than prime the studio series 38 prime but he's the same size as a uh, BBSS 102. So we're going to take a look. Well, actually he's taller. So we're going to take a look at some of the pictures here. Here is him next to uh, Dark of the Moon Grimlock. Here he is next to Studio Series 86 Grimlock. A little shorter. Studio Series Grimlock, I think it's about 8 inches, 8.5. Here he is standing above the original Studio Series Optimus Prime. He's about almost a head taller. And here he is a head taller than the premium version. I've never really seen the premium version up close, but I got to say the colors do pop. But if you ask me, I think I am okay with the regular version because it just makes more sense. And here we are with the two modes. So we have the uh, 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 metal slug tank and the jet mode. And yeah, that's definitely a metal slug tank. I don't know if they have it transformed correctly, but ooh, he just looked fire. I mean, this thing is fire, man. Triple changer? Oh, Lord, shut up and take my money. So you know a brother had to get two of them. And I just pre-ordered the case. I said, screw it. I got one in a box, and I got one I can play with, and I'm going to put back in the box anyway because I don't display movie figures. I only display my G1-inspired figures. So, But this definitely is going to get reviewed, and it's definitely going to be in a good place because I think this is going to be one of those toys you if you didn't buy this now you just going to be excuse my language arsed out and yeah again he, he's even taller than studio series as I mean studio series 102 Optimus Prime which is wow here he is talking to uh Bumblebee uh Starscream and yeah here he is standing next to of course Soundwave you know what I'm saying so yeah, I mean, he definitely has the height. Here's the fusion cannon. I mean, it looks like a fusion cannon. Very good. This thing is, man, I, all right, all right, all right. Enough talk, enough talk. I'm, boy, I ain't gonna be able to get this probably till January. It's fine by me, you know, because they, if they ship early from Entertainment Earth, whoo, I will be happy as I don't know what. But yeah, this is a definite must have. Whether you collect movie figures or not, I don't collect them all, but this is one I definitely have in my collection, and I will not, again, I will not pass this up. This is a very good looking figure. Hasbro, you did your thing, you put your foot in it, you you cooked it well, you, man, this, this, this is like, man, this thing looks really, really good, so, I mean, what are your thoughts? Leave them down in the comments below. And of course, please like, subscribe, and share, of course, if you can. If not, you know, I understand. But still, I know for a fact that a lot of people, whether you like G1 or not, want this figure. So this is Super Robot Ed, bringing more news and reviews. Until then, we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.